Welcome back guys. Um, today we're going to talk about a, well not a, my current, or current is when I've made this video, 62mm TC water block. So here it is. Shiny copper. Now, before I forget, you'll notice that this TEC does not have any um, tim on it. Thermal interface material, thermal paste. That's because I just chucked it in there and it's not screwed up properly, it's just for the video. So, yes, you do need uh, thermal paste on both sides of that. And that's with half inch compression bits power fittings on them. We'll take those off shall we and have a look on the inside because the outside is a pile of black plastic which doesn't look very exciting does it? Okay. Okay, that's the bottom, and that's the top, two part top. The main reason for two part tops is to reduce the bowing, which happens when you machine plastic because it's a stress material, and honestly, that is the bane of my life, trying to get things perfectly flat. That's the base, 62mm TC. And it's got the step in it to make it over uh, important components. To be honest, uh, motherboards don't tend to have a lot of problems with this anymore, but to be compatible with the official uh, Intel specifications, it's got that. Now, as an interesting size comparison, here is a normal uh, water block for cooling your CPU, which you will have seen in a lot of my videos, and all you can see is a reflection of some light bulbs. So shall we keep going, shall we? Why not? Okay, inside of this is flat. Not much to say there, it's flat. This side, however, is more interesting. Got some seals there. Can't miss them being red this time. And this one has the black seal on the bottom.
And obviously the point of this cutout here is to take the water that's going to be this size, or actually smaller, because the barb is actually quite a lot smaller. That's, that's the side that has the barb on it, this side. But this ends up being quite a lot narrower. Ten mil, and we need to spread that across sixty-two millimeters. So that's what we have the slot for here. So it goes in, goes left, right. And then we have the base. Which I'm not sure is in focus. Those are 0.3 slots, and there's a train out of them. Heaps, and you can see where the seal goes along. There's that little mark. There you go. That is it, as it stands at the moment. I'll reach over here while I find another one. There you go. Look at that. Ooh. The magic of editing. Or maybe not. Maybe making more than just one or two. So that's my current 62mm block and I hope you guys really like it and enjoy it and have fun with it. Uh, cooling your computers or whatever you want to cool with it. It's certainly a somewhat unique thing to do TC cool your computer in this day and age. I do believe it should be coming back though because with the uh, CPUs using less power than they did in the past and TECs getting more powerful it should be well and truly practical again. And of course I'd like to think that we've got much better blocks than we did a long time ago. So I hopefully you enjoyed that, and uh, if you have, uh, give it a like, maybe uh, subscribe if you haven't, and we shall see you on the next video. Thank you very much guys, thanks for watching, hey? pretty cool stuff, I guess it's supposed to be a bad joke. <laughs>